what's the deal? Because it has a tendency to roll off your shoulder if it's not under the uh, flap like this. Hey scouters, all right, so we're gonna learn how to keep that sash from sliding off your shoulder. You're gonna need an extra epaulette or a shoulder loop. I'm my honor. I'll do my best. The scout is trustworthy. Helpful. The first thing you need to do is measure where the shoulder loop and the sash meet. What's interesting is it actually came right to the hem border of this sash and almost to the badges, but you're gonna have to measure it on your scout. Uh, and I'm not going to, obviously, I can't sew it. I have to hand sew it, and I'm just going to tack one tack here and one tack on this side. I just want an itty bitty bit. Look at that. Can't tell. Okay, now we're going to go for the inside. I'm going to do it three times this time. Barely see it. So. We have sewn a shoulder loop onto a sash. That way we can attach it onto here and it won't shake around and be super loose. All right, so first, unbutton it and take the old one off. Then you put this one over the person. And get it on right. And then you want to put the shoulder thingy through the shoulder loop. Okay, make sure it's through. You wanna check, it is through. Okay, then we button it up right here. And we make sure it's all nice and straight. And now it's attached. This will not slip. A second tip for having your sash not slip. I got this from the Unofficial Scout Parent Handbook by David Howell. This is so cool. This is such a great book. Now I was thinking about this, you know, this would be a great gift for even the adult that is bringing their wee below over into your troop or anyone who uh, just has a lot of questions that still just doesn't feel like they've figured it out yet. It's really good. I recommend it. We have Jacob here, our model, and we're going to be showing another way to securely attach your sash to your shoulder strap. So here we have a modified shoulder strap. So where it looks regular right now, but on the underside, it has a soft piece of Velcro. Okay, and when you're just going regular day-to-day -day activities with your class A, you'd put it on like this, so it's the Velcro on, uh, on the underside. So with this, we don't need to buy an extra shoulder loop. Okay, so now we're going to put on the sash. We'll make sure that this is flipped with the Velcro facing up. Okay, and then now we put on the sash. Okay, we make sure, and right here we have the hard side of the velcro already sewn onto the sash and we line it up right there to where it sticks together and then this is another way to securely attach your sash towards or on the shoulder loop.